welcome to the Leading with Love podcast. I'm your host, Shauna Arthurs. The purpose of this podcast is to touch your heart, expand your soul, and help us all be everything we came here to be. We have interviews with amazing humans and solo episodes as well, all made to bring more love, more joy, and wisdom into your day. It's a growing list, so check back often and let's dive right in. Hello. This is my very first episode, both video and audio, and it will be uploaded everywhere I can find to upload it. I welcome you. Again, thank you for being here. First, may I say, there are many things that I have studied and watched and learned about what to say on a podcast and what not to say on a podcast, and you know what? I don't care. I'm going to throw it all out the window and I'm just going to say what comes to me because if I had planned anything or tried to, you know, control it or remember what to say, it would not be natural and it would not be me in my full presence with you here. And that is what this podcast is all about. It's about us being fully in our hearts. And I called it leading with love because in my opinion and in my observation, there is a very let's call it a lack of leadership in this world that is from the heart, that is from the truth of what and who we are. And I'm here to change that. I'm here to open your heart and hopefully just with my energy alone, but our words as well. I recorded my first interview with an incredible, incredible guest this morning, and I have more set up for the coming few days. So we will be launching with a few episodes, and I'm really, really excited and lit up and feeling in my purpose and it's really really cool for me to know that my purpose is to help you be in yours because I know that when we're in our hearts we feel the truth of who we are and I'm creating a bunch of products books and things that are that talk about all of this but this venue this um, particular platform this way of having conversations and being almost live pre-recorded but it's it's so much from the heart and it allows me to share I'm getting a shiver on that which always means truth is being spoken it's so much of an almost live venue that it allows me to just be to be exactly what I came here to be and have incredible conversations with people who are up to wonderful things in this world and giving their gifts and shining out everything they came here to shine out, and that is what this podcast is for. It's for us to be in our hearts and step up and do what we came here to do and be what we came here to be, and that is heart-based, heart-centered leadership, and we need that. We need me to be this. We need you to be this, and when you do that, you are inspiration and permission for other people to do the same. And even with the conversations I've already had here and the ones that are coming, these are amazing people. And I know, I know they're going to light up your heart and I know they're going to touch your soul and I know they're going to help you feel your purpose and and step up and just, mm, mm, just feel some connection in your day. I've had so many people, beautiful soul, family and friends, say to me, Shauna, you should have a podcast. It was never on my radar. I don't even listen to podcasts. I will start, and I have started as I've studied um, how to do this because I had to learn all the tech stuff. I had to learn how how to do this. It's not my forte at all. What my forte is is having conscious, beautiful, loving conversations, and I'm always leaving voice messages for people, and I just had so many people reflect to me Shauna, I love your voice. Shauna, I love listening to your messages. You should do a podcast. That finally I said, okay, let me do a podcast. So here we are, and this is the inaugural episode. And as I said, I have all these interviews lined up, like 10 or 15 interviews with incredible, incredible human beings. And I just wanted to come in here for this first one. And I'm thinking about all of you who said you're going to listen at work. You're going to listen in your car while you're driving. You're going to listen um, as you're going for a walk or a run. And it just makes my heart so happy that we have a venue like this, this incredible connection tool that is the internet where I can come and just speak to you and you can listen wherever and whenever you want. And I can bring some connection into your day into your heart, into your nervous system. I can share with you this essence of open-heartedness and love and 
my support for you and your support right back to me. It flows, the energy flows, and it is so incredible. What a world we live in. There are some weird things going on and we all know it and each of us has our own perspective, but it's been tough. And thank God for this connection. Thank you for this connection. Thank you for sharing if you do. Thank you for being in the love note. So for those of you who don't know, um, I created this little Telegram app called Love Notes Daily. Well, I didn't create the app, but I created a group on Telegram. And it's already got, gosh, 40-something people in it. It's only been um, less, maybe a couple of weeks. I just started with my friends, and it, it snowballed from there. And I, I feel, I think I know that there's going to be more and more people. And it's my way, another way of putting a little love out there every day and a little connection. There are so many chances to do that every day and invitations to share kindness and share love and share connection. You can be in the grocery store. It doesn't matter. Every little moment, you have a chance to be in your heart. And we need you to be in your heart so much. Every problem in this world, I swear, can be resolved by being in our hearts because that's where we connect with each other. That's where we get past the facade and instantly, it happens all the time. I have people come out from behind desks in um, stores, and, like stores and grocery stores and stuff to give me a hug because I just gave them a hit of love and connection. Just a minute, just a 30 second interaction can make such a difference when you're really coming from your soul and seeing that person. It's like water in the desert. We don't feel seen, most of us, um, and we don't get a lot of validation. So I'm here to see you, to tell you you're amazing, to tell you you are here for a reason, to tell you that the world would not be the same without you, and we need you. You have a very specific blueprint in this lifetime, and nobody else can fulfill your destiny. And you being here is amazing for me because then I get to encourage you and that makes me feel like I said in my purpose when I can help you feel in yours what an incredible win-win situation so I won't keep this long I just wanted to introduce myself and introduce this podcast and the reasons behind it because I know that most of us feel we can't make a difference or we can't do the thing and Gosh, even in the conversation I had this morning, my first podcast interview, we were talking about imposter syndrome and, you know, the lack of confidence that co comes when you're trying to be something you're not. And the more that you are your true self, you get out of your head, into your heart, and you just radiate this natural love. It's life force. It's joy. It's, it's all good things. Everything you're yearning for and striving for and trying to chase outside of you, it's all available right here in your heart and when you feel that and you own it you share your true gifts with us and we will know because it'll touch our hearts and it'll open our hearts and that's what I'm here to do for you and my guests are all incredible and we will be having these incredible conversations that move the needle on consciousness in this world I know because this is the kind of conversation I have all day every day and now I'm going to be sharing them with you guys and I am so so full of gratitude and hope and love and enthusiasm for this gorgeous, gorgeous venue. I'm really, really grateful for all of you who said, please do this. Um, so I'm going to sign off now and in either the show notes or and the end of the outro here with the beautiful, beautiful music that I love so much from my dear friend, who you will see in the credits as well. I just love this piece of music. It's such the perfect thing for the intro and outro. I'm so excited. Um, you will see the, the notes for the love notes to come in with Telegram, onto Telegram and join us because it's so well received. It's just a little three, four minute note every day, but it let it touch your heart and let you feel connected to a community because we all need that. We've all felt very isolated. So every way that I can bring this to you it is my joy to do so. So thank you again for being here. And I look forward to this very, very much. It's going to be really, really fun. Until next time, I'm signing off.
Wherever you are and whatever you're doing, I hope you enjoyed this episode and it helped you open your heart, feel inspired, and know that we are all connected. Please subscribe and share so this work can touch more people. This is how we co-create the world we want to live in. Thank you so much again for joining us and talk to you next time.